To fasten with the seat belt, take the lap part of the seat belt and pass it through the blue routings on either side of the seat and securely fasten the buckle. Take the diagonal part of the seat belt and place it through the blue routing on the back of the infant carrier. Ensure all of the blue routings have been used and that the car's seat belt is tight. Unfold the foot shield and the centre leg and place the Isofix arms into the Isofix guides of your vehicle. Ensure you use the yellow fitting guides and attach them to your Isofix system. More modern cars have the Isofix guides built in. Simply remove the cap to expose the fitting. Firmly push the base into the Isofix guides until an audible click is heard. When correctly installed, the indicator on the Isofix arms will change from red to green. Extend the centre leg by pressing the button and extend the leg until it makes contact with the car's floor. Place the port infant carrier onto the base rearward facing. When the port infant carrier is correctly fitted to the base, the yellow indicator will not be visible. Smith's Toy Superstores. If I were a toy. Smith's Toy Superstores. If I were a toy.